Now, Fox 56 Sports, sponsored by Arby's. Welcome back. Thanks for staying with us. Region 11 is filled with some talented teams, but it's tough to match what Great Crossing is putting out there on the floor. Fox 56 Sports Director Michael Epps caught up with their Janias Burrell in this week's Student Athlete of the Week. Now, from Fox 56 Sports, this is the Home Team Friday Night Student Athlete of the Week. Sponsored by Transylvania University. Go, you got it. Before the gym was even built, Janias Burrell was turning heads at a brand new Great Crossing High School. Janias has been with us since day one in our program. So when we beat you know, a new program back in 2019, 2020, he played for our freshman team as an eighth grader. And actually, he was going to... Um, he started for us in the summer when he's seventh grader going into eighth grade. The young man who currently is 5'9", he might have been 5'5 back then, not even an eighth grader, was getting buckets on varsity teams that summer before the season even started. And so as a seventh grader going into eighth grade, we actually played Scott County that summer at the KBC in the state tournament. He actually had 18 points. Uh, well, I'm only like 5'9", so... Like in basketball, you know, most people are bigger and stuff, so I just got to show. Oh, uh, well, it's definitely crazy. <laughs> now he's in his fourth year starting at point guard. Great Crossing is on the cusp of its 100th win in program history, and they're going to get it pretty quick. They're 18-1 and one so far this season, and the only loss in double overtime against a top out-of-state team. These guys are rolling. Well, well things has been doing good, uh, been shooting the ball better. Uh, we've been winning, <laughs> number one team in the state, so definitely good. Not just number one in the state, top 25 in the nation, making the cut on Max Prep's national high school basketball rankings. But these kids know it's all fluff. They had a fantastic regular season last year, but lost in the region tournament. This year, they have their eyes set on rough. Well, it's just like we just got to keep working hard. Like All the stuff we did in the regular season, it won't matter if we don't do it when it's time for tournament time. So we just got to keep progressing. In Georgetown, I'm Michael Epps, Fox 56 Sports.